Lectins are proteins naturally present in many plants, vegetables, and grains. They bind to carbohydrates on the surface of cells and organs, which can cause irritation or inflammation. While lectin-containing foods like legumes, soybeans, beets, tomatoes, and potatoes are acceptable for you in moderate amounts, too many can lead to health issues like arthritis, digestive problems, or autoimmune diseases. Lectins are a type of protein that can bind to sugar molecules and other proteins on cell surfaces. When they do this, they change the cell's shape and how they work. They can also bind to and damage healthy cells. Lectins in some foods, in fact, can cause problems when you eat them often. Lectins are proteins that live in plants, animals, and bacteria. Plant lectins are found in the seeds, while animal lectins are located in the tissue. It is important to know which lectins are bad for you, because there are some lectins that are good for your health. Lectins can be found in many foods that are part of the human diet, including potatoes, tomatoes, lentils, grapes, wheat germ, kidney beans, peanuts, soybeans, and more. These proteins can be toxic to humans because they can bind with cells on contact and act as an anti-digestive barrier. Lectins also cause inflammation by stimulating white blood cells production. The main reason why these proteins are so bad for you is because it causes inflammation by stimulating white blood cells production. This is not good for your health because it can lead to various problems. It's important to talk to your doctor or other professional before beginning any sort of supplementation or treatments. Feel free to contact us if you want us to give you the contact information of professionals who work with our network.